Hello everybody, welcome back to the video. Hello little thing, Porg. Hello. Yeah, you were made in Ireland. Yeah, they came down to Galway. Yeah, sorry. Um Star Wars. Yeah. Star Wars Tales from the Galaxy's Edge. Now I've already played a bit of this, but I've reset the whole storyline so I'm not jumping ahead in you or anything like that. I'm just doing the quick settings. Yes. Yes. Sorry, uh, but yeah, so welcome to Star Wars Tales from the Galaxy's Edge, and um, I used to be a big Star Wars fan, and we're just playing some Star Wars. So the only reason I'm doing this is because I recently got Star Wars posters for myself, and I'm like, hey, if I actually haven't played this in ages, wouldn't it be cool, but I'm like, wouldn't it be good if I just did a Star Wars video? I'm going into VR. In VR. It's so weird as I thought. What now? Yes. Oh, oh something's dying over here. What's dying? Oh, that is cool. Bit motion sickening, but cool. Nothing. You're already awake. Let me power everything up. Might take a sec. It's very quaint how you biotics have to sleep all the time, even though it seems like a colossal waste of your lifespan, but it does give inquisitive droids the opportunity to look through your things. That's an upside. I have to sleep. Mission the deck hand. Get to the cargo loading area. Alrighty then. Oh, that's scary. Gunk! It's gunk! You are a legend! Stop! Stop! They pathfinding on gunk. Stop! I thought they put pathfinding on you where you wouldn't collapse with me. I will. I'll probably turn this way because my fish tank was right where I was looking. This arrow was my guidance. <sighs> so I'm in the middle of space and what am I doing? Shush. Oh, are you really? Wow, amazing. Who do you think made you? <sighs> Sorry. I'm in the middle of star- I'm in the middle of space, you know, doing Star Wars stuff. My wrist is, you know, and what do I have to do? I just start unscrewing stuff because apparently- Because apparently we can't leave a lever actually working. Oh yes, I said lever, not lever. Hey, I want this. Oh, can I just... Um, num, num, num. I'm very powerful. Yep. Oh. Ah. ah. That's not good. Oh, well. Anything cool here? It's blue gunk! But you was actually pretty familiar. I know some people prefer places like Coruscant and... You can help me among them. Oh, close the Lugong, do you mind? I'll I'll screw you. Come here. He's electrified. That was a really bad joke. I have to do more screwing. I'm not a robot.
Oh, it's an actual working lever. Oh. Oh, that is rare. That is rare. Oh my god, that is rare. No. <laughs> I see dismantled droids. I'm sure the one that's actually piloting the ship's not like that. Why do I have to... No. I don't like these. I know what these do. They're really annoying. What are you? I don't know what that is. Oh, it's junk. Surely the robots powering the ship, or droids, sorry, that is driving the ship came in here, he'd be like, my brothers and sisters, or no, my automated comrades, no, and it just immediately, that's terrifying, and then immediately have a mental breakdown, even though they don't have a, I oh, know, Star Wars to have a conscience, that you forgot, no, don't come here, wait, oh thank god, he doesn't, he doesn't want to speak to me, I really wonder why. Oh no, he's gonna come up with this big screen, isn't he? The no. I'm not answering. Welcome home, a briefly. Only enough time to get your cargo unloaded and then <clears throat> off to pick up more parts for the droid depot. Hmm, you're due in the bit system in uh, 32 standard hours. How's everything going? Well, I hate you. I know you got a deal on this bar, Trooper, but it's falling apart. Maybe our next ship can be something more nimble? Like an X-Wing? Uh, we're not getting an X-Wing, Jack. Give me one good reason. Uh, I built you to pilot the freighter. Oh, you Maybe built him. Reasons. Okay, that explains it all. No, oh, that means the loader just launched. Back to work. I hate the him. The next container is ready. Coordinates are coming your way. Did I have to? Damn, that is big. That is big. Make sure to scan those parts from my line. They must be tagged for offering. I move the container into position and pin your compass with the coordinates. If NASA does not have something like this in the next 50 years, they have failed the world. Even though they're supposed to beat them to it. Anyway. Yes, hand, I know. I know you wanted to get off Batuu and see the galaxy, but did you ever think it would be as glamorous as doing things like scanning parts containers? Scan me. I always used to love doing that when I was younger. Just, you know, getting the scanners at the till and just scanning your hand or something like that. And you're like, I've been bought. Yes. My parents can bring me home now legally. Oh, money. Guys, I'm crushing the money. That's not good. So, remember when we were on Trandoshan and you stopped at that diner? What? Well, I interfaced with the security droid and it told me they've allowed droids in the resistance. That's good the for General you. General Organa herself sometimes travels with a protocol droid. I don't care. Can you imagine? No. That could be me one day. I, I don't care. I'm for them, but I call that woman's king. Or whatever General's way. I'm sorry. I know you're really excited because it's like droids and you want the same treatment as humans, but I don't care. I'm good at the remote droids. Be careful. Those can be nasty. You tell me that now? You tell- where are you? Huh. I know I said I played a bit of this already. I don't know if I did or not now. I've probably just ruined the whole thing. But I actually forget an awful lot of the starting bit. Have. I have the power of God and Star Wars to scan again. Yes, I too travel. Oh, what now? Uh, yeah. You ever have one of those times when a cloaked traitor in the corner of a dimly lit cantina pays you a lot of credits to transport no. your special packages? No. This is like that. That's called but smuggling. We're not smuggling them. But we're probably also not not smuggling. That's them. smuggling. I'm I don't want I'm side. not illegal. I'm not illegal. I've just gotten out of prison. I don't want this. I've just gotten released. I'm going back. Ah well. I can crouch. My legs are lie with me. Oh, 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 okay, yeah, no. If I can have this, I'm never going back to jail. 
Ah, yes, I look at it and it just goes on. Yes, I love doing that. I wish there was like a jump button instead of having to be this all the time. That'd be quite nice. I have no objective. Cool. Do I just have to go back up? Or what? Um. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's clearly what I have to do. Can I? Yes. That's not nice sound. Okay, so what do I do? That's very good. That means uh, that we just confirm. Uh, yes, you're going to have to turn on the docking bay in front of it. They're approaching from the port side, so that'll be the console you want. So the left hand side. Yeah, I know. I I once played Sea of Thieves and I had to learn off not learn off, but I just decided. Hey, wouldn't it be cool if I learned what port and starboard meant to impress me friends? They didn't care. I didn't care. Nobody cared. Yeah. Why did I move that up there? That is big. No. I want them trapped here. One down. Sensors say there's another. Whoa! Uh, can you guys out here? Hold on. I'm gonna try to get us out. He's reading my mind. They're attached. He's running now. You had one job. One job. Hulkridge, get to the crate I'm on. There's a pistol stuck inside. Yeah. I'll drop the blast door behind you! Did he say pistol? This is Star Wars. We don't deal with those things here. I'm sorry, the door doesn't understand the urgency of the situation. <sighs> Thank you. I was better ask, why do we have? I know how to use this thing, but I'm not going to. I keep forgetting this game's actually like made by Star by Lucasfilm. I keep turning that on, that was a horrible place to put it. The robot though, he had one or droid, I keep calling him a robot. He had one job! Don't let them on! What's he do? He lets them on! And now I have to get these! Now things have to get ugly! Also, yeah, there's no holding, so I just have to put my hand like that. I guess I'm going hand solo mode. Guavin, Guavin, Guavian death guy. Whoa! You may call yourself the Death Gang, but I'm the Death Cargo Transport. Yeah, it sounded better in my head. Picture me like the truck driver who just has a rock ship. No! Hi. Hello. Look, the First Order is paying a small fortune for a piece of your cargo, and lucky you, you're here to claim it. So, there are two ways this can go. You can hide and weep and just hope really, really hard we don't find you. But eventually, it's always, oh, there you are. Blam, blam, dead. Or option two, you just put your hands up. It's pretty easy. Just like this. I give up, Tara. See? I ain't going to be putting your head in a plate later on, Tara. I bet I can get a good price for you on Zagaria. Oh, now you want to so, sell me? Think about it. I won't be. See you soon. I won't be thinking about it. Where's your soldiers? They're dead. Wherever they are.
think you can hide Should after killing my friend. Oh no, I won't be giving up. You killed my your friend. Average raider's little death hand. You're tangling with the Guavian death gang. Means you should ask yourself: Is one piece of cargo really worth it? Do I look like I care? No. Oh, uh, you have to jettison the cargo so they can't get it. Oh, you have to jettison the cargo. Yeah, not like I could just call the bloody. Oh wait, no. First order run this place. I forgot. Bloody galactic civil wars. Hey, idiots! Get in there and make that stop. Yeah, they're not. They're kind of dead. Really dead. Extremely dead. You hear that? The ship just dipped into Batu's atmosphere. So, you can ride it into the dirt like a giant metal coffin. Or you can get out with us. Just put the blaster down. That's <laughs> what we came for. <laughs> no. <laughs> you have to jettison the cargo. The blood dead to the escape pod. I hate him. Am I cool? Unless I personally kill you first. Oh, try. Go I ahead. Like more satisfying. Let's go ahead. That. Come on. Come and have a go. Come on. Oh, perfect. Now the escape pod. Uh, wow. It's not. Oh, are you all right? Oh, come on. Come on. Try. They don't stand a chance. I'm too powerful. like I'm um, yeah <laughs> yeah I kind of underestimated them yeah <laughs> oh god that's on video now forever isn't it whoa why are they trying to kill me the ship's dying Wonders always. Don't need that. Give me the money. Give me the money. I am a businessman. I'm a businessman in times of crisis. Blue gunk. Come on. Come on, go. I'm sorry. You were a brave gunk. Having my final moment of gunk. You are a hero and you shall be missed. Boop. She didn't kill me. She didn't kill me. Da 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 da. Da, 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 da. Wait, what? I still have to do some more. Oh! <laughs> it's a blast door! Oh! That's not good! Okay, I set your coordinates for the Sami and Sons jump class. Pushing the pod's landing. Stay alive and meet me in Cecil's Life Cantina. 